Memo 146 Reading Passage Since the 1960s jobs have been decentralizing from the central city to the suburbs. Traditionally, especially from the standpoint of transportation planning, the suburbs were viewed as bedrooms for the central city workforce. Radial transportation systems, focused on the urban core, were organized in large part around moving workers from the suburbs to the central city in the morning and back to the suburbs again in the evening. But this simple pattern now describes only a small portion of current reality. In Worcester in 1960, for example, 42% of suburban workers had jobs in the central city. By 2015 only 20% of employed people living in the suburbs worked in the central city, the same proportion as for all metro areas in 2010. Similarly, the proportion of the metropolitan labor force that works in the city of Worcester as opposed to surrounding suburbs has declined from more than two-thirds in 1960 to less than one-third in 2015.